Looks All right. The chances are you may already know the story of Penguin Bloom, mm. a little magpie who saved an Aussie family after a tragic accident, stole their mother's ability to walk. Now the remarkable story of the Bloom family and Penguin the magpie is being made into a Hollywood film. She needs a name. Penguin. The boys and I were struggling. Oh, you're struggling. Yes, it's all of us. Are you still you, Sam? No. You are. You are. So beautiful. Oh, isn't it? And our very own Naomi Watts is at the centre of the new movie and we're pleased to say she joins us now live from LA. Naomi, Hi. so lovely to see you. How's LA? Hi, guys. <laughs> oh, it's actually a sunny, lovely day. Well, which is, you know, we, that's not much of a surprise. It's often sunny in California. Um, but it's probably not quite as sunny and gorgeous as it is there. Oh. <laughs> where you are. No, it is nice. It's probably a little bit too hot and, and whatnot, but um, look, everyone's doing okay today because the Queensland borders are open and families are being reunited <laughs> everywhere, Naomi, so it's really nice. So tell us about this. Um, you're starring in and producing Penguin Bloom. It is such mm. a, a powerful story, isn't it? It is, it is. And I, I saw that um, with all the families reuniting and it's wonderful. And I think that's sort of the essence of what this film is. Um, even um, through hardship, they're um, able to go through this horrific experience that changed their lives, particularly Sam's forever. And um, but through this little bird and its magical arrival, um, they find a way to heal. And although Sam's body is not changed um, or not back to what it was, it, her spirits were lifted and, um, and the power of that family unity is what drives us all at the end of the day. And we're seeing it now more than ever in um, these horrific times. Yeah, I mean, look, the, the Bloom family, they're so gorgeous. Uh, I, I did a story with them for 60 Minutes several years ago and Sam and Cam and their gorgeous boys, you've got Reuben, Noah and Ollie, they're amazing. Yes, I saw that interview, by the way, and I used it in my research, so thank you. Oh, my absolute <laughs> pleasure. Sam is one of the most inspiring people that, that, I've, that I've ever met and she's very honest about what she's gone through. She doesn't make it all rosy. Yeah. But I know what the family's like. How involved were they in this process? very involved um, and yes um, to speak to what you were saying she's just an open book and um, that was what made it uh, well, it's never easy but it was it more um, possible to play her in uh, and honor her story in the most authentic way it was just through her generosity and she literally yeah talks about the depths of darkness um, as well as how um, how you know she had positive breakthroughs at the same time, and it was important that we show all of those colours um, in order for you to understand you know what this story is about, the changes that this family went through. Yeah, and I think for for people at home, what's important for them to know is that they were on a holiday in Thailand, and they were all standing on a balcony together, and Sam leant against it, and and it gave way, and that's when she lost the use of her legs. And this family has gone through this together. But can you explain to people at home the difference that a magpie, a broken little magpie called Penguin, made to the family, and how, in a way, it saved Sam? Yeah, I think it was just the change of rhythm, you know, that she'd been trying to um, make the adjustments in her in her head, um, in her mindset. Um, the body wasn't working in the ways that she had been used to moving around. And, um, and so she was just stuck with her thoughts and everybody was trying to um, cheer her up and make her feel better. And she was trying to be stoic and, you know, do her best to, to keep her spirits up. And, and then there was just this distraction, this beautiful distraction um, 
where she was left with the job of, of uh, healing this bird um, by her son Noah. And, um, and I think she was, it was an escape. It was a simple escape that allowed her to get away from the dark thoughts that were just spinning through her mind daily. And, um, and yeah, it, through her healing this bird, I think they, it, the same thing happened with her own heal, path of healing. Oh, it's uh, beautifully articulated. Um, what I love at the moment is that, that we have um, Australian women um, um, from an acting point of view, a producing point of view with Bruna, um, producing these, mm. this great television um, all around the world. Um, you, must feel, you must feel great about where you are right now and, and also Nick, and, um, and you're doing great stuff. Oh, thank you. Yes. Mm. Um, and, and Emma Cooper, by the way, I'm sure she's watching. Hi, Emma. She's <laughs> one of our producing um, partners. And Bruna Papandrea. Yeah, it was really um, wonderful to be able to be at the beginning stages of this. And um, we were all uh, captivated by the book, Cam's photography, of course, and the story being so deeply compelling about the family, the fact that it would reach audiences universally and in um in unique and, and special ways yeah. and um and yes we we are able to be there and watch it develop it was kind of it's our baby um mm. well it's sam's story obviously but yeah. we shared it with her and hopefully we've done it justice to, and um hopefully the audiences connect with it and we'll be it's able a, to it's... watch it in cinemas which is very very exciting well are we going to see you back here sometime soon we miss you oh, i <laughs> Please, I know, just open up the international borders. <laughs> I know that they can, um, we can do the quarantine, but it's a bit hard for me um, with school schedules and stuff, so um, to get away. But um, I'm hoping I can get there soon. And we badly really want to, we also badly want to see you in something with Nick. Um, I think that, <laughs> I mean, it's like the cup runneth over if we see that sometime soon. It's great to see you, Naomi. Um, all the very best to you and your family um, over mm. the coming weeks and whatnot. And, and well done. On, it's so hard to get anything made. Uh, and you've made something really beautiful here. Mm. So thanks, you, thanks for your time. Something really special. Oh, and thank important. you. Thank you so much, guys. Lovely to see Have you. Have a great day. And we know the Bloom family love you for all the right reasons. Oh, that's so <laughs> lovely to hear. They're wonderful people. Yeah, and really. all our love to them this morning I'm sure they're watching I did tell yeah. them that we were chatting to you today so bye Sam <laughs> love you bye Cam I miss you <laughs> oh they weren't for you oh. they weren't for you but you know you can take them thank you, you. Just one. Well,